Good morning and uh, welcome uh, to a new video from North of Norway. As you can see in the description, uh, this video is about my new tripod, which I have here. Uh, Benro, uh, I'm not sure how the name of the tripod, I think it's TMA38CL. Uh, it's a carbon uh, tripod with a gimbal, a G5 gimbal, um, for my bigger lens for my 400 millimeter. Um, until now I used uh, these tripods, I have two of these, uh, Siri tripods, they are very nice, they are uh, small and very light, very nice for traveling and they are also in carbon and light, um, but uh, I experience uh, uh, when I use my bigger uh, lens on these uh, smaller ones, uh, there is some issue with the stability and uh, also the ball heads are a little bit uh, small uh, and sometimes I have some problems with my bigger lens. I also have a, a ball head for this one. Uh, I have not here with me now. Uh, I, today I just uh, try to uh, check out the gimbal. Um, I never had a gimbal before, that's the first time. And I'm really looking forward to to uh, check it out, and that's what actually the stay is about. I just want to get used to a new equipment. Every time when I um, I get new equipment, I uh, I uh, do some test runs before I uh, start really using it, so I get a little bit used to it. Um, I believe it will be much better with my uh, 400 mm on these ones and than on uh, the small ones. So really looking forward to uh, to test it out today. Um, for this test, I'm here with my uh, Fortite in the Force for the Red Squirrel. Um, I will uh, fill up the uh, bird feeder and uh, lay out some nuts and just uh, stay here and then we'll see how I uh, can move my 400 millimeter with this gimbal, how fast it is. Yes, now I uh, placed my uh, 400 mm on the gimbal and I already see uh, that uh, this will give me a lot of advantages. Uh, I look back to these uh, smaller tripods with the small uh, ball heads. Uh, I very often the uh, lens was or the camera was a little bit too heavy and uh, the tripod was falling over. Uh, but now with this uh, bigger tripod and the gimbal, I can turn around the camera very fast and all the uh, angles and nothing will fall over and oh, that's really perfect. Now I really want to try it out. So I place out some nuts and seeds and we will see if I uh, get a few small birds in front of my camera. And Maybe the, even the squirrel, we will see.
it's getting a little bit cold now and uh, today anyway this video was just supposed to be a short video and just uh, a short test about uh, my new uh, tripod with the gimbal uh, right now my my fingers on the right hand to push all the buttons on my camera are quite numb because it's really cold you see that I when I'm taking pictures I use very often my bare hands and then I get really cold on the fingers uh, when I have these gloves on I'm not uh, really able to push and use all buttons it's very difficult and uh, the other ones with the fingers uh, they are also a little bit thick so I not always uh, find the buttons and uh, when my fingers are a little bit numb sometimes you try to push the button in to the uh, back uh, button for focusing but then uh, I try to push but because you don't have any feelings on your thumb you you don't really push the button so it's uh, really difficult so um, I think I, I soon had to go back to the cabin and get a little bit warm but uh, the new tripod is it's absolutely amazing I really love that it, uh, um, the the tripod in itself uh, it's uh, a little bit longer and bigger than uh, the smaller ones a little thicker and more stable so it really um, uh, is really uh, nice uh, to get stability with my big lens and then this gimbal I never had a gimbal before so I'm really happy to get this gimbal um, all these uh, how you call it knots or what it, I'm not sure they're English uh, name for it but they are big and easy to open and uh, and tighten again so that's really nice and it's perfect I can just turn around my um, camera in all directions very easy I can pu put it up put it down and I just can't take off my hands and it won't fall over or whatever it just uh, stays in place uh, so the test was nice so I got used to uh, to the gimbal and I'm really satisfied and but anyway uh, to take pictures of these small birds it's uh, not very easy they are so fast and right now here in this forest there are it's so uh, dense so there are so many branches that it's uh, not very easy and uh, but uh, I got a few videos and uh, and probably a very few uh, images but anyway uh, this was to test out my new equipment and I'm very satisfied so uh, thanks for watching and I had to go back to the cabin and get warm and hopefully I see you next time.